have been praying since the storm really started, and we're thankful that that these families have been able to um, escape with really only minor injuries. That was Michigan Lieutenant Governor Garland Gilchrist after what we've just learned was a tornado hit a mobile home park last night in Monroe County. You can see from this drone footage a house flipped over, one just torn to pieces. Christy Gerlet spent the day in Frenchtown Township talking to the people there. Christy, first and foremost, is anyone hurt? Melissa, the good news here is that there were no fatalities and no major injuries. You can see behind me some of the debris that has been left behind, the tree branches, the foam. About 30 homes were severely damaged. The entire property is without power. Officials say between 10 and 11 last night, they received more than 215 emergency calls. High winds tore through the mobile home park, throwing trees, piercing cars. Over 80 residents had to be evacuated earlier today when there was a danger of gas leaks. Now, French Township and the Red Cross are helping displaced families. Earlier, Lieutenant Governor Gilcrest was here meeting with residents and checking in with people. I spoke to several neighbors about what it was like when the tornado struck. Our whole house shook. Everything like it, it shook our windows, shook the house. We've seen our our vehicles shaking. It, it was pretty scary. It, it was all over with before we even heard the sirens. So again, the good news is that there were no fatalities and no major injuries. Reporting live, Christy Gerlet, WTOL 11.